old people, we like this. We get up, yeah. we bow, we let the chair come. My son, you know, like this. Yeah. <laughs> Jackie Chan, who is best known as one of Hollywood's favorite martial artists, actor, and stuntman, is quite possibly one of the most recognizable celebrities on the planet. Jackie has had luxurious homes located all over the world, including Beverly Hills, Miami, China, and Hong Kong. Since 2015, he has a beautiful French villa seconds away from the Beverly Hotel to call home. He has lived there since 2015, which considering how busy he's been would only make sense keeping a dig this close to work. While most people don't know this, Jackie Chan is a lover of real estate investment. This international superstar is also very active in the real estate sector. We'll take a look at this massive $10.8 million estate in Beverly Hills, Jackie calls home, plus other places he has owned around the world. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, so please do not show up at any private residences because it is not safe for anyone. The Hong Kong-born movie star who has a net worth of $400 million. Jackie Chan has become known for his kung fu, martial arts, and blockbuster action movies over an incredible, successful career spanning multiple decades. And who can forget that Jackie Chan is well known for doing his own stunts? Tell us some of the injuries that you have gotten. Uh, skull. Mm. I cracked my skull. Three times no, two is gone. Shoulder broken, 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 <laughs> broken. Crack, 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 crack. Yeah. Although Jackie Chan began his career in various Eastern movies, he has branched out to capture the attention of a global audience, often appearing in Western films. Low key, Jackie Chan is also a talented singer and has released many successful albums. In many cases, he sang the theme songs for his movies. Some consider him to be the most widely recognized film actor in the world, which makes sense when you consider the massive population of China and other Eastern nations. Chan's attempt to break into Hollywood started slow, and he frequently traveled back to Hong Kong to work on various films. During this time, he started to experiment with even more daring stunts, and this gained the attention of an international audience. See kids, dreams do come true. After starring in Rush Hour alongside Chris Tucker in 1998, he became a household name within the American film industry, which has led him to his almost half a billion dollar net worth and real estate across the globe. Ah, uh, dong. <gasps> Hey, what's going on guys, it's your boy Marlon Palmer and today we're bringing you another house tour here for you on Famous Entertainment. Now 95% of you guys keep coming back to watch the videos but not subscribing. I'm gonna need you to change that, I'm gonna need you to fix your life, get it together right now, subscribe. We post videos every day. We previously reported on the homes of Joe Rogan, but only recently did the news of his mega Texas mansion come to light. So now that we got details on that new place, it's time for an update. So look out for that. He's also apparently listed at one of his Bell Canyon homes on the market. So we'll take a look at those too. If you guys like these videos, please ring that bell for notifications. Follow me on Instagram at thatdoomitfly to chat some more. And let me know whose house tour to do next in the comments down below. Let's get into the video. Jackie Chan's Beverly Hills, California home was quite possibly his best snag during his real estate ventures. We're talking about an $11.6 million home. This beautifully remodeled French villa was located in prime Beverly Hills, just north of Sunset Boulevard, and seconds away from the Beverly Hills Hotel. This mansion was situated on a large, over 30,000 square foot lot, and obviously this property was gated. Now, the actual compound clocks in at around 7,600 square feet of living space. Not too shabby, if I do say so myself. If you manage to enter through the double iron gates, the front lawn boasts a large motor court with fountain that comes complete with rolling lawns. Upon entry, this massive compound features a dramatic two-story formal entry and spectacularly detailed designs displayed throughout the home. Some of the glorious designs include an intricate golden staircase to the stained glass windows in the master bathroom. Jackie's entrance reveals an absolutely stunning living room, which contains a high foyer featuring an enamel inlaid chandelier. I mean, would you expect anything less from Jackie? Beyond the living room, guests are greeted by elegant formal dining room and a wood paneled family room that makes dining for the family quite cozy. The family room includes a piano and a state of the art sound system, not to mention the pad comes complete with a step down bar, a wine cellar for those who fancy a Chardonnay, and a gourmet kitchen. I'm guessing all those stunts probably made Jackie a little hungry. The kitchen also features a center island and rotunda breakfast room to give the guests the option of where to enjoy their meals. The second floor landing sitting room comes complete with a bar that adjoins to the tremendous master suite, a bar attached to your bedroom. <laughs> Does it get any more luxurious than that? Included in the master suite is a fireplace and sitting room to keep extra warm and cozy. 
The master bedroom also comes with dual walk-in closets and luxurious white marble bathrooms to relax after a long day's work. Included in the compound are two additional guests for family bathroom suites upstairs in addition to a junior suite with two bedrooms aloft with bath. Possibly the best guest room is the one located downstairs. It has its own gym, powder, and laundry room. We can see Jackie Chan's family and guests fighting over the guest rooms with ease. Perhaps almost as dazzling as the fountain in the front is Jackie Chan's glamorous backyard that features lush lawns and landscape. The backyard offers a large and serene setting that is also a great space for entertaining. The backyard comes with abundant patio space decked out with a barbecue, perfect for a summer party. Guests can splurge in the pool with its very own waterfalls. Upon cooling off in the pool, guests can relax in a mansion spa or lift a little in the gym. While this was the most glamorous of Jackie Chan's real estate snags, he has literally lived all over the world. Some of Jackie's most notable homes have included Miami, Australia, Phuket Island, China, and Hong Kong. Does Jackie Chan live in Mexico? No. Beijing, but I have an office in Shanghai, Taiwan. Actually, I'm living around the world. Jackie keeps a relatively low profile, but we managed to snag a few photos of Jackie's former luxurious homes. Check out the one in Miami that features a little taste of South Asia. Just look at the waterfront property with palm trees swaying above the dock, or the red building on top of the hill in Hong Kong. Now apparently in recent news, two apartments in Beijing that are home to movie star Jackie Chan are being forcibly put up for auction, and the reason appears to be an ownership dispute. The adjacent apartments in a residential compound in the capital city's Dongzim district are where Chan and his family have lived since 2007. According to mainland Chinese media, they have combined area of 13,000 square feet, six bedrooms, and three living areas. The market value of the pair is reported as 14.6 million, though they were to be offered at auction in September with a starting price of 10.5 million. Chan is understood to have paid some 4.9 million for the pair after doing some promotional work for the developer. Media have reported that one of the apartments was where Jackie Chan's son, JC, was caught by Beijing police in 2014 while in possession of marijuana. JC was eventually sentenced to six months in jail. All right, so I think I'll bring this house tour to an end here. We got to take a look at the legendary Jackie Chan's former home in Beverly Hills, plus the recent drama surrounding his houses in Beijing. After seeing that $11.6 million house he snagged, what did you guys think? Was it everything you hoped for and more with Jackie Chan? Personally, I was a huge fan of the waterfalls and the pool. That really did it for me. I was really hoping for some more stunt guided things like a, a trampoline or something, I don't know. You guys can uh, go ahead and rate the house in the comments down below. Let me know who you guys would like to see on the next house tour. Follow me on Instagram at that Doom and Fly, and I'll see you guys next time.